How's everybody doing? So, I was on Amazon the other day, and um, I picked this up. It's um, it's an upscaler. You um, hook up composite to here, and um, it comes out through HDMI, which means you could um, you could play it on an HD TV, or in my case, um, my computer monitor. Uh, with my Avermedia capture card, an HDMI to VGA adapter, and a VGA splitter. So, yeah, it's a little roundabout, but it works. Um, so I wanted to see, like, this is like $10, so I don't expect much out of it, but at least I thought I could make a pretty good video, you know? So, yeah, um... I'm gonna try it out and uh, yeah we'll see what happens okay so here is the uh, Famicom I'm gonna be playing the um, Japanese Super Mario Brothers 2 now first of all I don't like the widescreen so I'm gonna fix that and that is the first um, real problem with this um, converter um, yeah, that does clear up, but man, that was a bad first impression. It's alright for what it is, it's like only $10, but if, you, if you're really serious about recording uh, gameplay, you should probably get something a little more expensive, because you're probably going to get better quality. So yeah, there's, um, there's the Famicom. We're going to move on to the Super Famicom in a moment. There we go. Um, it's a little bright, but, you know, it, it works. It's a little better than the uh, Famicom. It didn't have as many issues, though you will see a little bit of that. Um, I think that's, those are like artifacts, um, probably from the converter itself. So I'm not sure if it's that or maybe it's just uh, how it you know interacts with my capture card. So yeah, that was uh, Super Nintendo. Now we're moving on to PC Engine, and this I think is where the um, issues kind of start to fade because this actually looks pretty good for what it is. Yeah, it works pretty well, uh, and this game's called Download. It's uh, not a very well-known game, but it is a really good one. I'd rank it among like Life Force and Blazing Lasers as some of my favorite shooters. Got like really like fast uh, parallax scrolling, which I like. And I don't think the PC Engine was really made for that level of parallax scrolling. At least I don't think it was, but um, they found a way. And this is a Hue card game, it's not a CD game, so it's not like, you know, you had that extra space to work with. No, they actually fit all this onto a Hue card, which is pretty impressive. So yeah, there's the first boss, I just kicked his ass. And, uh, I'm gonna move on to the Sega Genesis. This is also okay. I do notice a little bit of pop-in, but or like um, artifacts from the converter but other than that it looks pretty good like if it didn't force it into widescreen if, if it had just you know been like this then I would give it a higher recommendation and also if it didn't have so many like um, artifacts in my Famicom uh, footage then I would give this a glowing recommendation, but as it is, it does seem to have a few too many problems. Um, and the last uh, system I'm going to record is, of course, the Nintendo 64. Now it's a little dark, but that could just be blamed on the game itself, I think, or just like the the way, because um, I, I I know like. 
a lot of Nintendo 64 games, even when I play it on CRT, are kind of dark. So, yeah. But here it looks uh, pretty okay. So, I've had some time to ponder and ponder about this, uh, about this upscaler, but honestly, I mean, when it works, it works very well. Um, with the PC Engine footage, that was actually pretty good. Um, basically, like, everything after the, the Famicom footage was better. Um, but honestly, I would have loved to record some Famicom footage of me playing Super Mario Bros. 2, the Japanese version. And, um, yeah. Because I, um, I was trying to record that, um, that Let's Play, right? I have the first part on YouTube, but um, the power went out, and so I lost my progress on part two. Yeah. I guess you could say I'm really unsure about this, but I'm, I'm probably going to return it and see what else I can get. So with that said, um, this is Jake Spider Monkey 1994, as always, signing out. Have a wonderful day, and I got a frame from my Mario 3 poster in the background. I hope you noticed that. Um, yeah, it's awesome.